Straight ahead on WDKD, we'll feel any and coming fair thing, but one of the last few big festivals of the summer, we gathered the reactions from the fair attendees on this year's county fair. Plus, three local municipalities are ready to pledge or to make a pledge towards our environment. And we'll check out the micro wrestling event in Alpena last night. You're watching Jenny Bailey's Network. WDKD Which was totally WDKD politically WDKD. incorrect, by the way. Live from the shores of Thunder Bay, this is WDKD 11 Late Night News. Live. Bringing you the latest in local news, weather, and sports. With an update on today and your first look at tomorrow, this is WBKB 11 Late Night News. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Owen Mejia Salasume. With the Alpena County Fair starting to come down those last two days, we caught up with some of the visitors to the, to the fair and got their reactions on this year's fair. Their band too. As the summer is starting to wind down, the Alpena County Fair is one of the last biggest festivals that will take place this summer. With the fair being as big as it is, it tends to bring people from far away to enjoy a weekend of fun. There are so many different types of people that come around here that seem to be having a lot of fun. We saw it on the news at <laughs> We saw it on the news and um, just trying to spend the last few days of summer out, so we figured we'd come outside and do something. We're from south of the state, um, south of Ann Arbor. I'm from somewhere else. I'm from Mount Pleasant. I seen it on Facebook about it, and I was like, I better come down here, check this out. With such a wide variety of people coming from all parts of the state, yes. I was curious to know what they thought about this year's Alpena County Fair. Oh, it's been awesome, especially the bigger rides and more so I got stuff. stuff like that. I, everybody I've talked to, they loved it. They loved it, and they just thought it was the greatest idea that, that you know, they put it together. People are just loving what they see and what they do, and... Um, Especially the rides. Um, it's really warm today and like windy, and I'm really excited because I get to ride a lot of rides that I like. Uh, I've had a lot of fun so far. I've had some uh, fried Oreos. It's fun to watch my dad or my daughter's uh, ride. I got a three year old running around here somewhere, so it's a lot of fun to watch them, uh, you know, enjoy themselves. You know? I'm really excited because this is my first time here. I am from Mount Pleasant, actually, so. I am. Oh, it's pretty good. I mean, there's a lot of laughter. There are so many people coming through. I heard and screaming. It just seems to be really cheerful so far. The Alpena County Fair is on its last two days, with the final day of the fair being tomorrow on Saturday. So don't miss out on the family-friendly fun, and if you can, be sure to thank the hard-working staff of the Alpena County Fair, whose work made this year's fair possible. The city of Alpena, the it. township, and the county are all, are all working.